What's going on? Zach and Nurtach here from Eat the World. Hello everybody! Yeah, we are ready to eat the whole world. But before we do that, we need to eat some snacks. <laughs> and it's Chinese snacks. That's right. So we have gone to the supermarket before we did this video. And, uh, we also ha have some things that just look outright disgusting. Let's get started. Uh, What's the pick? What's the first? How about this thing? Wow, it's a strong smell. Oh my god. It's uh, a really strong flavor. Um, <laughs> it's, yeah, really <laughs> strong. Quite a little bit salty. Salt uh, Yeah, it's not bad. This one, I'll give it a 7 out of 10. Mine is like 9. I love it. Nine. This is chocolate flavor, a little chip. I that it's chocolate flavored. It seems to just be chocolate. Um. Uh, sure. Yeah, this part here seems to be kind of just like a, I don't know how to describe. It's like a foamy snack material with a little chocolate layer on top. Yeah. yeah. I give it like a four and a half out of ten. Five. Five. Five? Yeah, it's not my favorite. Open this one. We can shade one together. Okay. What is it actually? The box, on the box it's literally called a snow biscuit. Oh yeah, it's 63% corn. Corn. And uh, sugar. And uh, yeah, and salt. Oh. Yeah. Ding. Ding. Mm. This is one of my favorite Chinese snacks. Yeah, actually this is not bad. It's a little sweet. Mm -hmm. Um, nice and crunchy, uh, but still salty. Yeah, a snow biscuit is not bad. I'll give it a, I'll give it a seven out of ten. Ah, uh, mine is ten to ten. 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 It's a really like Next, we're gonna go with it is uh, Dove chocolate. It is uh, matcha tea flavored. Yeah. Yeah. So that's um. Kind of a Chinese spin on a Western classic. <laughs> have you had this one before? Oh yeah. <laughs> <laughs> okay, I haven't had any I of have, these before. I have something here you haven't seen yet. I have never ever tasted, and I still don't think I can taste, but we will taste it today for you guys. It's, oh. it's gonna come soon. It's gonna come real soon. Okay, here it is. Matcha flavored. Uh, Dove chocolate. I mean, that's so good. Yeah, it is good. It tastes a lot like milk chocolate to me, but um, mm -hmm. yeah. I mean, there's, there's, it's definitely. I can feel like it's still chocolate, but it's a little more subdued, and uh, you know, I can feel the the matcha. Yeah. I can really feel the matcha influence in it. Yeah, because matcha itself is really intense, you know. Mm -hmm. Yeah, this is my favorite one so far. Oh. I, I give it, I give it an eight out of ten. Oh, mine is like ten to ten. <laughs> Next one, let's go for mm -hmm. yummy, yummy. Put this in my tummy. Mm -hmm. uh, what I wouldn't give for prawn crackers. Smell? I'm not oh, sure. I think wow. I, I think I tasted it before. All right. Wow, they they really succeeded in oh capturing the taste of of uh, that particular uh, <laughs> sea life bottom feeder. Um, Where is our water? <laughs> yeah, it's uh, <laughs> empty. We didn't fill it up before we started the video. So since that last one was really disgusting, was something a little yummier this time. Mm -hmm. This is coconut juice here. They actually, it's so interesting, they actually call it, uh, fresh coconut meat. Hey, you got first drink. Is it yummy? So, very yummy. <laughs> yeah, I like it a lot. I like it a lot. It's, it's really good. Um, so freshing. This one I'm gonna give like a 
Nine out of ten. Nine. Nine out of ten. Yeah. Mmm. Yummy. Yummy. Mm, something I never had before. Yeah. It's um. It, it literally is translated to roasted fresh eel. Um. It's uh just like basically dried eel skin. <laughs> Um, I would give it, uh, hmm. <laughs> you, you say first this time. Three. Three? Uh, I was gonna say a five, but you've influenced me to say four now. <laughs> so I go with dried papaya. Smells wow. awesome. Yeah, it smells like gummy bears. Yeah. Do you want to? Yeah. Ding. Oh mmm. Awesome. Very good. Probably quite healthy. It's well preserved. It's not too dry. It's uh, a little sweet, but not too sweet. That's so good. It's a 9.5 for me. 9.5. Oh, mine is like nine to, uh, 10 to 10. 10.10? <laughs> oh. All right. This is uh, It's basically like uh, dried, dried uh, tofu. <laughs> Thing. It, this one looks like it's a human skin. That smells good. All right, and this one's for me. All right, go ahead. Oh, smells good. Very Chinese. Mm. Seasoning is all Chinese. Yeah, I don't know how to describe it. Well, me too. <laughs> Doesn't disgust you? Uh, you still like it? Maybe because we already get used to eat Chinese food. Uh huh. I, I would give this one a four out of ten. Oh, mine is five. Uh, <laughs> look what else I have. Ta da! Okay, this is sort of a, uh, a jelly gummy. Uh, it's grape and apple inside a little container thing. Um, well, it's overfilled a little bit. <laughs> uh, uh, this is not bad. If, if it didn't fall all over my pants, I would probably give it like a seven. But because it's like all over my knee and it's disgusting, I'm gonna give it like a four. Minus six. Nice. Yeah, it says that it's without oil and it's a little salty. So let's just try this thing out. Mm. That's good. It, it actually tastes just like the no biscuit, but um, a little less, a little less sweet, mm -hmm. a little more, I don't know, syrupy or something. Mm -hmm. um, I'll give it a seven out of ten. Wow. Another ten. Minus ten to ten. Yeah. It's um, it's called syrup of plum, and it's a drink. Uh, I, I I picked this one out because uh, it was just an interesting looking drink in the aisle there. All right, Nurtach. Mm. Oh my god, I don't know. It doesn't feel like it's something you should drink. It feels like it's for chemistry. Like, I don't know how to say. It tastes like... It tastes like cough syrup to me. Nah. It's, uh, yeah, the consistency is a little strange. It's sort of thick, but it, 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 it's syrup-like, I guess. Uh, a three or a four. I'll say three and a half out of ten. It's two. Ouch. Oh, it's cute. Kitty Land. Yes, and um, Kitty Land. Every piece biscuit has a little code for you. Let's see what's your code. It says, I need earmuffs. It's written in English. That's so cute. Mine is, your home is over there. <laughs> Aww not bad. Chocolate but not super sweet. To me it absolutely tastes like something I would find in the state. I'll give it like an 8. This is uh, Hawthorne. Alright, cheers. Mmm. Mmm. So sour. Yeah, it's good. A dried fruit um, mm -hmm. little square. Um, it's quite good. I would I would give it like uh, an 8 out of 10. 10 out of 10. Mmm. Yeah. Okay. I think I react to all of your scores. Oh. Oh. 
<laughs> Is it time? Uh, I really don't know. Yeah. How do you feel? You also never tasted that before. Yeah, I've, I've never had this in my entire life, but we can't really do a China Snacks video without having like the staple China snack. Sijua, uh, spicy chicken claws. This is um, the most important part of Chinese cuisine. Not really, okay? Please don't like call me out on the oh comments. Oh my gosh. Uh, I I really like. Oh my god. They're Ooh. individually packaged, ready for us to just sort of open them up and explore what it means to eat a spicy chicken claw. <laughs> oh my god. Oh, it smells horrible. Oh gosh. Ash, can you pick the like the most gross one? A minute. Cheers. <laughs> You go first. Hmm. How is it? <laughs> uh. Uh, uh. You know? Uh. Mm. Yeah, honestly, the problem, it tastes like chicken, sure, but it's a claw, you know? It's like, I, 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 I mean, it's a claw. There's, there's no meat, there's nothing to eat. It's more just something you sort of chew on and taste the flavor of. Why do people like this? I really don't know. Mm. I don't really desire to eat much more than I have, which is not <laughs> a lot. Um, uh, wow, you know, I've been in China almost five years. I've always said, oh, I've never eaten one of those things. Oh, yeah. And now I finally have for the oh, first yeah. time. A staple China experience, and I am giving it a 1 out of 10. 1 out of 10. Alright, wow. Uh, some really incredible things, some things that were just plain horrible. Uh, it's very much like China is as a country itself, you know? You have everything on the full spectrum of like yeah. the wonderful, incredible, to just like horrible and disgusting and wretched. Go ahead and leave a comment. Tell us what your favorite Chinese snack is, or if there's something that you're curious about, go ahead and let us know, because we love to reply to the comments. And uh, if you haven't already, make sure to hit the subscription button. It's right mm -hmm. here under Nurtach. Under me. <laughs> <laughs> we can see it right now. And uh, thank you for your time. We've got a lot more cool stuff coming up, so stay tuned. All right, thank you for watching, guys. See you next time. Bye-bye.